the lights. I'm in New York. Can you guys see? That's Times Square behind me. I literally got in today at like 5 p.m. We went and saw a Broadway show. It was so good. I love this Broadway show. It is my first one and it probably won't be the last. But anyways, context, background. I kind of just jumped in and was like, I'm in New York. Um, so I landed here at around 5 p.m. I literally had 45 seconds to get ready because we had a Broadway show to go to. We literally just got back. Um, Nas and Mel are downstairs taking pictures and we are about to change into something a little bit more comfortable. We dressed up a little for the um, show. So we are about to throw on something comfortable and go walk around Times Square. I haven't been to New York for so long. Like, I don't even remember. When was the last time I was in New York? I think it was like one of the beauty cons 12 years ago. Not, not 12 years ago. But it's been a long time since I've been to New York. And honestly, so far, I love it. I've only been here a few hours. But it's a little bit cleaner than I remember it. I don't know if I'm remembering differently. But like, the airport was pretty clean. The room that we have. I remember when Naz and I would come here for beauty con and we would get hotels they would be much smaller than this I don't know so far I love it but it's only been a few hours my mind might change and my face is turning different colors from all of the beautiful lights outside the view is so bomb I am so excited to show you guys this view um tomorrow when it's like light outside but yeah so I am about to change I'm waiting for Naz and Mel to come back so this is a double bedroom Naz is currently with Mel and actually we have those connecting doors so they're in the room next to me which is pretty cool I really love that so yeah I'm about to change and I'll see you guys in just a minute hi guys good morning so last night I told you guys we were gonna go out and explore Times Square we didn't we ended up getting really tired and just went to bed and you guys I slept in and I didn't even realize so the shades here are the blackout shades you guys can see like it was pitch black in here and I really wanted to go to sleep with a view but the lights were just so bright it didn't let me sleep so I closed the shades right next thing I know I wake up at 12 p.m. I don't know if I was just really tired from traveling I don't know what happened but I woke up like am I dreaming right now did I really wake up this late but yeah so that happened so um, ever since then I've just been editing my um, Ohio vlog that one's gonna be a pretty long vlog I have so much to edit it's probably gonna be like a long 40 minute vlog I don't even know I just took so much footage during that trip so I was going through and editing that this morning and then today is Rissa and Kwan's baby shower so what time is it I think right now it's about like two or so I am about to get ready and head to the baby shower let me show you guys Times Square during the day I showed you guys last night how it looked like but let me just show you guys so beautiful freaking love it hi guys so i just got dressed i got ready but guys i'm really my armpit i always i'm always so self-conscious about armpits anyways don't look at my armpit <laughs> but anyways um i really like my short hair like usually it would come to here so let me show you guys the outfit i have a mirror right here but the thing is is that oh my god these lights are changing my makeup is not 14 different colors guys it's the light this mirror over here so i tried to back up to show you guys my full outfit but i hit the closet door so bear with me okay so here is what i'm wearing this dress is from miss lola official i'm wearing the bottegas and i'm also gonna be carrying oh my god my room is a mess my prada bag right here cute little fit all black Nas is vlogging right now too. Guys, look at how our rooms are set up. So these, like, this door would close and my room would be, like, more private, I guess. I mean, you know, a separate room. Like, if we didn't know each other, these doors would be closed. But since we family, our doors is open. And when we go in, that's, like, so cool. And then it's their room. Look at Mel. All cleaned up. Yeah. <laughs> we got Nas. So cute. Yes, hey, beautiful. 
Looks so good. Thank you. Mouse is our Uber's here. Uber's here? Yes. All right, let's go. Where's my phone? Where's my life? Where's my lipstick? My mask? <laughs> So it is the next day. Last night, the baby shower was so beautiful. Rissa looked so gorgeous in her dress. She literally looked like a princess all night. It was so much fun. The food was bomb. The music was bomb. The drinks was bomb. It was just a really beautiful baby shower. And I just really enjoyed it. So um, Nas actually moved into my room. So um, for the next two days, we are sharing this room together, which will be really fun. So we're about to go get something to eat. But before I leave, I wanted to quickly mention to you guys an app that I use to book my New York flight so I use an app called hopper and hopper is a free app that you can download that will always find and secure you the cheapest rates on your hotel flights and car rentals so on this trip I think I saved about like $80 using the app which i probably wouldn't have if i would have used any other source to book my flight one of the features that i love is that they have a color-coded calendar which shows you the cheapest travel dates the green ones are the best deals and the red ones are the most expensive also if you're planning a trip and you're not really sure if you want to book right away you can use the feature watch trip which will notify you when the best prices are available they monitor prices 24 7 and they also have a prediction technology Technology, which predicts future prices with 95% accuracy so you have peace of mind that you're getting the best deals which this takes such a weight off when you're trying to book you know a future trip because you're constantly looking up different websites trying to find the best deals and then you're worried if the prices go up or down now you don't have to worry about that it's all on one app and you have a little buddy helping you out there's also another feature called price freeze which you can lock in the lowest price so if you see a trip and you're not quite sure you want to book or you're ready to book you can lock in that price and if the price goes higher you will still pay the lower price and if the price somehow goes lower you will end up paying the lower price so this is bomb this takes such a stress out of you know trying to find the best deals because you're not worried if the the price goes higher you're just you know freezing a price if it goes lower that's bomb on top of all the ways hopper already saves you money they also have their own rewards program called carrot cash so yeah guys don't hesitate to download hopper it's legit like having your own travel mentor when you're booking your travels also if you click the link in my description box to download the app new users will get their first ten dollars in carrot cash to be used towards their first hotel booking so yeah guys hopper is legit bomb for traveling definitely check it out um i'm about to throw on a little jacket and go meet up with Nas. hey guys so i just met up with Nas and Mel and we are about to get an uber we were gonna take the metro to the Upper East Side but we're trying to get there a little bit quicker because we actually the metro is quicker however we don't know where the station is so we just like got an uber um, and we are about to go to the Upper East Side right now we just kind of walk near our hotel I don't know exactly where we're at but it's very it's very New York and the gloomy day adds to it
have been, Naz, how many steps did we walk today? Well, we walked almost 10,000 because we went out this morning. Oh, yeah. Well, we walked I walked 5, like five. Yeah. But it was good. We just got back. We um, got salads from Sweet Green. We're starving. Here's yours. Thank you. We're about to eat real quick. And we have dinner plans, but we're too hungry. So we're just about to eat a little salad. I got the harvest. Um, Nas got the harvest too, mm -hmm. right? Is that what it's called, harvest? Yes. It has like apples in there. It's bomb. So, good. so we're about to eat this. What'd you eat? Mm -hmm. That's what he ate. Booga, 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 booga. That's what he ate. La, 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 la. <laughs> They're talking on the phone. But here's what the salad looks like. It comes with sweet potatoes, but I took that off. From sweet green. Guys, so on the subway, um, Nas was sitting next to someone. She had like a green bag. I noticed really? it, but I think it like bled on her hands because it was like a tight squeeze. I don't know if you guys could see the green, but it's actually coming out with a pen. Tied to go pen saves the day. You guys know how I feel about these. I keep one everywhere. Nas made fun of me for it, but guess what, Nas? I've never <laughs> what are made you fun of you for now? it. I think it's pretty convenient. I love tied. It's coming out. Don't worry about it. I hope so because I was really sad. I know. I really love these do you pants. Do you know yours. why? Because I got so many compliments on these today. Oh, yeah. Even my DMs, they're like, where'd you get these pants? So the subway ride was like half an hour. We finally made it. We walked another block. Towards the end, Nas and I were like, when are we going to get there? We're not used to this kind of walking. I walked 10,000 steps today, you guys. I mean, it's good exercise. But it's okay. We're here. We made it. It looks really cute. It's Greek food. in show. It's actually really funny. I saw Cat Williams when he performed or was on stage um, like years ago when I went to Ohio State. He had a show there and it's really cool because now he's in like a big stadium. So. Hey guys, what's up? So it is the next day. Um, last night where I left you guys, so we went to the show. However, Cat didn't come on, so we went to the Cat Williams comedy show. So we were there for about two hours, and he didn't come on. I think he came on a little bit later. And I don't know, it was it was just not our vibe. So Naz and I decided to go to a dessert shop together, which I really loved the spot. Um, the music was super loud there, so I couldn't really vlog, but I did take clips on my phone, and I'm just gonna insert them here. We had like a chocolate fondue, had this chocolate espresso martini. Um, what else did we have? Oh, we had a cake. It was like a creme brulee cake. It was so good. The cake was so good. And you guys know me, if it's not chocolate, I'm like, eh. But no, that cake was bomb. Oh, guys, another thing. So um, when we went to the show, you know how they like check your bag, check everything? So they checked my bag and they saw my vlog camera, right? They're like, oh, you can't bring that in there. I'm like, so stupid. right, because we have cameras on our phones, you know? Like if I wanted to record something, I can easily do it on my phone. We could bring in a phone, but not a camera. He's like, oh, you can't bring that in. And I'm like, um, so, so what do you want me to do? He's like, you need to leave it out, um, out in the cubbies or something. And I was just like, I'm not doing that. And Nas was like, oh my God, you're being so mean. But, cubbies, yeah. so make sound a lot worse than no, it. he first yes, said cubbies. No, he didn't tell me get Nas. He was like, they're little cubbies. And I'm like, what do you mean by cubbies? I'm not leaving my vlog camera Yasmin, in a cubby. Yasmin looked him dead in the face and was like, I'm not doing that. I was like, <laughs> oh my god guys when things get serious i'm like no 
Um, so then he's like, no, it's guest services. So we walk up to guest services and then Naz and I finesse. So there was a line and he didn't stay with us. Um, so Naz and I are like waiting in line and Naz is like, let's just like get out of line. <laughs> and I'm like, right. And then I'm like, okay, I, I had to use the restroom. I'm like, let's just go to the restroom. And if they come searching for us, like if it's that serious, I guess I'll put it in guest services. So we go to the bathroom and we don't see him again. So yeah, that happened. So and now we just got dressed. We're about to go to this burlesque brunch, which I'm super excited for. And I can't wait to eat because I'm literally starving. I haven't eaten since the where I showed you guys the Greek spot. That place was really, really good too. Um, so yeah, let's go. Hey guys, so we are at the burlesque brunch. This is actually so cute, guys. Look at my coffee. It's a vibe. It's a whole vibe. Let me show you guys um, the restaurant. Or So the show is going to be right in front of us. And they're going to dance around us. I'm a little confused how this is going to work out too. But we'll see. This coffee is so good. This is all I wanted this morning. Look at how pretty this place is, guys. not doing it justice. I wish you guys were here. Guys, I love this kind of music. And it's coffee. That does, everything looks, what did you get, Mel? What is that? That looks so good. It's not all you beef or eggs, and that's like what everything is. Yeah. <laughs> What yours is the steak? Yeah. So we got it so we could good. split half and half. Naz and I love to do half seas. So we can get the best of both worlds. Right? Like tomatoes. That, that's all you baby. Yeah. Naz like loves tomatoes. Beautiful. This is the lox plate. It'd be like little flowers. I know, that's so cute. Cheese. Guys, everything has been bomb so far. We had one of these little cupcakes, so good. This cheesy bread, so good. Like this, yeah, and then it has like, see how it has one yeah. second when it counts. We're trying to figure out how Mel's stories always look popping. Like, right, the picture. we can learn to take the same exact photo, but Mel's is like so because he uses different lenses. Like, when you open it, they like brighten it up. Okay, mine is the 12. I want to get the, I want to get the new. Just wait. Does anybody have the new iPhone? Let me know if you guys like it, because I want to get it.
guys so we just finished the burlesque show it was really good the food was bomb do you like it yeah the food was really really good oh my god i was and i like that it was like a live band yeah they all did so well so now we're in soho it just started raining a little bit i know and we're both wearing heels not showing your back I just made a purchase. I was trying some shoes. Hi, love. So after we went shopping in Soho, we came back and we were just so exhausted. I edited a few pictures. Edited. I literally hate saying that word because I I sound like I'm stuttering. Edit. Edit it. I. You guys know what I'm saying. So we came back. We laid down. Um, I at some pictures. They turned out bomb. Nas took these for me. So cute. I love them. I posted my pics and then we are about to go eat and then go out. So I'm excited for that. Um, Nas and Mel are meeting me downstairs. I wanted to vlog a little bit before I head out. It's just when I go outside, there's just so much noise and music and I feel like I can't like talk to you guys and I'm like wearing a mask. I'm probably going to end the vlog here. I have an early morning flight so... I'm just going to go out tonight. I probably won't get much sleep. Um, come back pack and then head to the airport i hope you guys enjoy this new york vlog and i'll see you guys next time bye loves me and my girls done for that you know what we gonna do i took two shots of the liquor one more round just on you you like us i'm moving keep moving feel like them boys them sugar but i got my eye on you you know my body calling for you to come and dance upon it, boy, why ain't it?